final thing we'll talk about today on our tour, folks. Thank you so much for taking the time to join us on our tour of Boston's Green Trail. I am going to be talking just a little bit about the New England Holocaust Memorial right over this way. Uh, the New England Holocaust Memorial was established in 1995 by Holocaust survivor Stephen Ross, who survived over 10 different concentration camps before he immigrated to the United States. In the 1990s, he wanted to go through steps just a little bit to the he wanted to memorialize some of the folks that he had known that he had bought, other Jewish uh, people in the Holocaust. And so he began to gather funds and institutions in, in the early 90s, eventually culminating in the dedication in October of 1995. The memorial has these towers here that are 54 feet tall. Each panel of glass is ended with many, many seven-digit numbers. These seven-digit numbers represent lives lost during the Holocaust, Jewish lives lost. If you were to take all the panels out and count up all the seven-digit numbers, you might think that's a lot, but it's 2,300,000 approximately numbers, which is still less than half of Jewish folks that were murdered in the Holocaust. It is a sobering reminder of what has happened in the past and could happen again in the future if people are not present and watching carefully. Thank you folks so much for joining us today on our tour of Boston's historic Green Trail. I know that was kind of a sober talk and there's a lot of saxophone in the background. <laughs> didn't intend for that to happen. But I want to thank you folks so much for taking the time to walk along the Green Trail. And after our tour is included, feel free to take a saunter through and reflect on the New England Hall.